These are two apples. One was drawn by a human, and the other was generated using artificial intelligence. Which is which, though? Not that easy, right? Situations like this are only going to become more common as time goes on. AI can paint pictures, write essays, code, make music, and successfully pass numerous university entrance exams. That's already a lot, but what else can artificial intelligence do? First, let's take a look at how it works. These days, artificial intelligence is literally everywhere. Search engines, voice assistants, self-driving cars, or even enemies in video games. One kind of AI that has gotten especially interesting lately are the Large Language Models, or LLMs for short. Many of these models function kind of like a chatbot and can be controlled by the user using simple text messages. Before LLMs can work, they first have to be trained. This requires huge amounts of data that are analyzed using complicated algorithms. This means that the AI doesn't just simply memorize the information, but is also able to recognize patterns and connections. The model is learning constantly. Even when interacting with the user, it can commit new data to memory and connect it with existing knowledge. Using this system, the AI then tries to predict what the most likely answer to a given question is. The answer is split into little parts, and for each following segment, the AI calculates the most likely next part. For this, the model relies on the data on which it is trained. This training data consists of millions of books, articles, and websites, billions of words in total. Generating images works in a similar way, although here the model is being trained with images instead of with texts. For many instructions, this process already works pretty well. Nevertheless, errors and inaccuracies still happen that the model will present as the truth. Sources or citations generated by AI can sometimes be entirely fabricated. Due to the model's approach of attempting to predict each segment of an answer, it operates mostly on probabilities and has no real concept of true and false. This means that an AI is only as good as the data sets on which it was trained. This is why it is especially important to interact with artificial intelligence in a conscious and responsible manner, and to have a fundamental understanding of how it works. From many sides, there is also a demand for new regulations and laws for artificial intelligence, with development pauses and even a complete ban on AI being a hotly debated topic as well. The technology may still be in its infancy, but even experts aren't sure where future developments may lead. Even the influence that AI might have on sectors like education or medicine remains to be seen but it's a pretty safe bet that a lot is going to change due to artificial intelligence.